All right, so the first thing I do is I turn the dial here to manual, turn the camera on, and basically, I always turn my shutter speed to a thousandth of a second just because I think that's the best shutter speed to capture uh, fast moving action in sports. And then I'll go to my f-stop and I'll turn that as low as possible, especially for indoor shooting. And then uh, for the gym that I shoot in, uh, I usually shoot at ISO 4000 just because that's right before the 5D Mark III starts to get uh, a little bit grainy. So after I change the ISO, I go ahead into the AF mode and turn that to AI Servo. So basically what that does is that allows me to focus quicker and keep the focus on my subject. And after this point, um, I usually change from single shooting to high speed continuous just so I can get as many shots in as I can. And then after that, I'll go ahead and change my white balance. Sometimes I use auto white balance in certain gyms or um, you know, in the gym that I usually shoot at, I'll shoot at 4200. So after that, I'll change the metering mode. I've been shooting in evaluative metering, but this last game that I shot, I used spot metering and it actually worked pretty well. And um, you can kind of play around with that and see what works best for you in the gym that you're shooting in. Center weighted average also works pretty well if your subject's always in the center of the photo. So then I make sure I have the right tracking set for the sport that I'm shooting. And if you go into this uh, autofocus menu, you'll see all these little displays on the side. And I usually choose case four for basketball and soccer because that's what it suggests. And so you can click on that and basically hold the info button down and kind of scroll and see what each case means. And then here's another good tip. If you're looking, trying to preview the photos after you take them and you want to see if they're in focus, this menu right here can magnify the image if you hit the magnifying glass button there on the left. And usually I have it set to two, but I think four times probably is a good a good starting point also so that you can see if your photos actually are in focus really quickly. So here I'm going to show you guys just kind of what it looks like through the GoPro and show you guys a couple photos that I took at the last game and just kind of see what I'm seeing and hopefully you guys can get a feel for um, the gym that I'm shooting in, the lighting and just kind of see how the settings that I use work with that lighting. And if you guys haven't seen any of my other videos, I use the Canon 5D Mark III with the 70 to 200 f2.8 version 2 lens. And if you guys thought this video was helpful, please hit the like button and subscribe and we'll make videos every week for you guys.